Spice also is yeah, they are tough, tough cookies. Tough cookies. <laughs> yes. And there we start, and Budweiss gets the ball, um, trying to pass. They're getting really fast through the goals. Um, Basket trying here to really score. It's a tough beginning of the game. Um, uh, but the goalie of goal number 24, we haven't read the team list, number 24, <laughs> sorry for that, no problem. number 24 um, from goal, goals broke through, that's Lobethno Meneses, and we are now moving the ball f around the Budweiss basket trying here to establish a quite nice game. It's a really fast change from one attacking the goal to the um, Pudiewicze goal here in white. Um, they're playing right now at the close tag also it means it's always a side where no uh, change players come in but we have a flying change here like they do in ice uh. hockey. Six players in the water normally ideally six outside so if no. you want to change. Oh, that's ah, close. that was very, very close, close, but good recover by the Czech team. And oh, this pass back when you recover the ball, that shouldn't be done actually. It's better to pass forward because it's dangerous, really dangerous. Uh, but they're doing great. They're now trying to start a counter attack. They had a, a hard game today, if I remember correct, correctly. They already had uh, um, a game against Hesu. Yes. So that you game. know that was a tough game, and also the goals uh, had to uh, against Boston, I think. So yep. let's see how you know how the, the the teams are coping with the tiredness yes. with all quite the last two days. Yeah. Right now we have like an equal game. We have in the live chat uh, Andrea who says hallo aus Darmstadt, hallo zurück von Berlin. And we still at the goals basket trying to, uh, the, the Budweiss team is really trying to score here, really aggressively going in there. The defense of goals still holding these attacks, fighting them off, really getting in there. Um, Oh, that's a change well, that by the goalie, and there's been a tag, and, that's and goal. that was a goal. Great job by the Czech. Just, yes. uh, I couldn't see uh, the number. Me neither. But that was a good attack, and actually it's when the goalie changed it, I was really good. I'm thinking, ah, this is a, a dangerous moment, because then the, the, the defender was not being able to help anymore, and then the attacker was right on the head, so... Um, good job, but I feel uh, we have one and a half times to go. And wow, that was oh, almost was an empty basket. But yes, the, the three we white have. players came in really fast. So number 24, Lobby from uh, Gold, is really uh, an offensive player trying to get in there, trying to build up chances for their team. The rest is now coming in, but we have four position of white team of Budweiss again um, and now we're in the middle and wow that was a great great save from uh, the goals I mean the Czech did a, not a, quite a, a good pass and it was intercepted so now they're above in the surface and they're trying to come from three meters Passing the defender, passing Ooh, to the next. Fast, uh, he was right there, but Halian. tackled away by a white player. And they again they trying his chance on the close set from the backside, but they managed it's to They're being tackled away, away by the Czechs. I mean, they're, That's they're like doing they're a good job. Doing um, the Czechs are quite good. Now we have still we still in our possession of goals, trying to get in there. They speed it up a little bit their game. But the Czech players are really a, a, a physical team. I, I, yes, I would they say play so, yeah. more with strength. And physical, that's, yeah. I didn't see the Australians play that physical as the Czech did. And we have one Australian the goal, the goal is trying to push but there's up. Still the defender, he got hold of in there and, sorry. <laughs> it's like so close and it's such a tense game, so 
Uh, we apologize if we talk simultaneously <laughs> at the same time. You can go. That's passion. We have now the closed corner. And now number three is coming from the open side, but it was stopped and blocked and the ball pass was passed and it is still above the goal as one of the Australian right above the goal and could not push it down because the, the, it was saved by one of the white players. Now they recover the ball and then a counter attack, two players coming through. The goal is alone against two and that's a goal. That's a goal that went into the um, gap that you have between yeah. uh, the, sh the neck and the goal, the basket. Yes. <laughs> so it was, so was pushing yeah, physically strong and against took some uh, the goal. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So now it's 2 0. Yeah. And the goal needs to. Uh, pay attention that, I mean, if they want to win or at least tie the game so they can go to penalties, they need to be very uh, assertive with, with, with defending and not letting these counters come through because otherwise, yeah, they won't, won't be able to recover. Now it's a uh, timeout for Budacevic. And let's see if now the Australians can uh, think of a way of maybe better attack because they have, they had a couple of dangerous situations, but the checks are, are very good on letting them come and then getting the ball once they're attacking. So I don't know how they, if they need to move the ball a little bit faster, I guess if they go with this strength game, the check have more experience with that. So yes. they need to look for another way. Anyone watching? From Czech Republic, 80 people. Australia. We have Czech fans from Australia. This is the game for the. Was the yeah. So back at the game, um, having a nice uh, check from goals here at the. Check basket trying to get in there. Three uh, minutes forty seconds of first half to play. We play here two halves of ten minutes with a three-minute pause in the middle of changing sides and doing substitutions. If they brought enough players, we have two, two and we now have a tech again from the check. I don't know if some of the check, but I think that some of the check also played in the World Championship this year. So they gathered quite the a lot, they yeah. play, yes. and they gathered quite a lot of experience. Maybe some of the Australian players as well. And they're right now back in ball position. Goal is great counter attack pass. from the goal. Let's see if they there can was, now. Did you saw that? I think there was um, pulling um, off the shirt because one of the shirts got up. That's normally not happening because they're really tied on to the body. Yeah, uh, and that's another nice attack in waves from the goals resolving in a scrum at the surface cool. now the ball went down and the Czech team recovered it so let's see if the goals can stop because the last time this is how they got the goal to so have the defender in position the goalie is in position That's and not change don't change now don't change now and they changed and tried to change in the third the goal moment forward. when the ball was so right underneath the, the head of the goalie so then there was a goal and this is 3-0 and i so see that coming um, in here um, it's going to be difficult really for the goals to change this this game around i mean uh, the first half of the time is, is almost uh, over and a 3-0 and even though they're fighting very well, the Australian team, they don't manage to change fast enough to switch from the attack into the defense. And then the Czechs are being able to swim counter attacks and score. They have done this at least twice. So let's see what happened now. The Czech recovered the ball and are about five, four meters away from the goalie of the Australian team. They are coming. And... Uh, the defender could uh, do something and the next uh, four again. checkers was blocking but now we have again the attacker on the head of the goalie and the next check is coming so now 
They still in possession of the ball. The captain bring the balls up, and now they're diving in. A ver. What happened? The referee call from I think the surface referee. The ball try. It's a free throw. It's a free throw. Against is going to be a free throw for goals here. Maybe they can use that chance and put it into a goal. Really nice. Trying to attack here. Passing with a lot of bad wise players there. I think they are both thirsty for a win here and trying really heat it up the game. Going both sides. We're now in ball possession of the Czech player. So the also the girls on the LC team is really doing a great job. They're really nicely defending and yeah. trying to get in there. And that's sometimes not so easy against some physical players like Footwise. No. Now the goalie went up, he couldn't anymore. I don't know. That's a, a difficult that's situation. a little bit of pushing without uh, ball. I mean that was a little bit confusing but the time's up. So now we have three minutes of the halftime. Yes. And uh, three zero for the Czech team. And it looks I mean it doesn't look yes. like the goals can really change this. I mean still have ten minutes, but they were really having problems to attack and they were having even more problems to stop the counter attack of the Czech. So yes. I don't think maybe I you know I think they maybe one goal because they did have a good moment where it was really risky. Yes. But that was at the beginning, the first five, six minutes of the game. Yeah. Then the second half, they were more struggling to keep possession of the ball. Yes. So I don't know now if they are going to be able to well change some tactics or change sometimes. Some you know, sometimes also. if they, yeah, I some think there's somebody of the Czech team getting ready or just putting on his no, mask. No, he just put the mask. Uh. So it would be really nice to see quite change of the game so that um, goal find their way back into the game, um, attacking a little bit more, getting there past the defense of the Czech, but the Czech are really good set up in the defense. So Yeah, so they need to have a, like a faster game. If they do the strength play of the Czech, I don't think they have a chance because the Czech are like bigger and they have uh, yes. that's that's their tactic so they need to take them out of their tactic out of the comfort zone where the Czechs feel good we just saw a huddle up of the goals again they're just really doing this team building and mentally thing which they did before the games and it's really nice to see here and we see I think Wolf taking pictures there Yes, Wolf is all around, walking around, taking pictures, making selfies, updating the stories of Instagram and Facebook. So we have here 91, uh, 81 uh, persons watching this uh, 39th game of Champions Cup here at Berlin. So if you have any questions or comments of how we do the live stream, if you have any for me, for example, it's my second day in commentaries, if you have any um, to critique or what I can do better, then just tell me so. Constructive critique, I would say it's advices yes. and being loving and caring, we're all doing this, we are not professionals, uh, we do it because we love the sport and we want to help it make better. And so be kind, um, yes, and loving, and, and tell us what we can do better. We're open for for constructive advice. Critique. Yes, that's, <laughs> that's a good word. So here we are. Uh, the Czech are in possession of the ball, and the goals are they are fighting for every inch. They are now it's still in the middle of the pool, and. Good, Passing well done. behind the back really nicely from the Czech player, um, but the goal players are aware of it, trying to get there, but we're still in a way for take off. Um, but twice here, a really good chance, but he got up, passed to another player, passing back, I think it was a double pass, passing down again, and there comes the second wave. Coming but there more, I mean, oh, Ooh, that was the attack right on the goalie. That was really that was close, tough. yeah. 
And now we okay, have a referee call, happen. pushing without ball. That's so now free throw, four goals. The goals have a possibility to maybe uh, take advantage of the uh, free throw. Now they're coming. There was a there pass. Was really nice there was a pass. Yeah. Trying to come from the open side is always That's not the best idea. new technique yeah. to hold the ball. Did you saw the, the goal player holding the ball with two hands, like cuddling it? So normally you grab it with, with one hand. But he got pushed away towards the goal there. Um, so he positioned. Oh, there was a close There was nobody on there. A uh, defender got grip of the ball and pushing it out. That was a really nice thread of the ball and it's a call, referee call again, holding free throw for goals. Who are the players for the Australian team was the question. So uh, I just read quickly the, the, the first names. Um, they're Frederick, Hannah, Ricardo, Jake, David, Daniel, Nicholas, Jared, Victor, Rob, Luke. Lobby, John, Jody, and Benjamin. Um, yep, yes. And for Budovic, uh, it's uh, Jan, Philip, Jaroslav, Martin, Tomasz, Jakub, uh, Philip, Tomasz, the second, Jakub again, uh, Alex, Pavel, Jakub, the third, and Joseph. <laughs> so, working in the game, we're in the middle of the pool, and the Czech have recovered the ball and trying to counter attack, going up passing two players of the Australian team, passing down again and continue. That's well nice, nicely done. And now it's the attacker against the goalie that they almost did not realize that the and attacker there was the ball. There was a really strong uh, push with the arm um, of the Czech player, so he really used his physical strings to push hardly the ball into the goal. I mean, there was the defender was in position, the yes. goalie too, but the check arrived so quickly that the the goalie was just changing with the other one and did not realize that he had premeditated the attacker uh, on his neck. Yes. So we have now the goals trying to attack, but and something then happened. The referee called the referee going up, holding, holding without ball for bus wise. That's an unclear. Separating of the teams, time stop. That means the the. I think it's a timeout for goals here. It looks it's a timeout for goals here. Um, yep. Hello. Jeff. We have almost a little bit over the half of time, yes. and I get four zero. I mean. The Czech team is going to win this game, I think. I mean, with six minutes and four goals, I don't think they can That's have an opportunity to change. Not the way they're really interesting. quite tight. Yeah, really interesting because I really thought goals would go in there really fast. Uh, and making it here. Uh, Czech players looking into our camera here, number 23. That's uh, Tomas. The first, just say so. He has an unpronounceable last name. That would be a nice Instagram challenge, just reading out last names of the Czech team. Here. Oh, number 13? Yeah. Or 23? Number 23, Czech team. Team is Likci. <laughs> I don't know that. <laughs> I don't speak. Help us. Okay, here we are back in the game. The Czech have the ball. And they are trying to start their next counter attack. There's one player already under the goalie of the goal and the ball still hasn't reached him. Something happened. Pushing and now trying to get back. There's a free throw, four goals. There's five minutes 40 left in this game. People nicely diving here around the basket, trying to establish attack. That's the first real chance for goals, but he lost the yeah, ball. To there's three guys three on one. No, three there check. was like before was another chance. It was like at the bot. It was like. Now we have three goals. They are trying to attack the goalie, but 
This is like a fortress of the Czech there. The Look at that. <laughs> Five minutes to go, and we are now in the surface fighting for the ball. And, and they're the missing the defense for the first time the here, but they go. Oh, yeah, that's a good try. Team, fantastic. Really well played. Really earned. Really well done. I mean, four one. This they have attacking like that yes. before, but they were not as. Um, I mean, that's uh, successful. I mean, because that's the Czech what, yes. did not lose the control of the defense like that's they did now. That's what we wanted to see from yeah. Australia. And we knew they could do that. So, yes. so we we're not being partial here. I said before Australia would be winning, but now we have a four-one. So uh, the more physical and strong team here is Budweiser at the 39th game. But right now, um, towards the end of the second half, of almost four minutes left. Oh, it's another wow! Very oh, right. fantastic. Very cut you. Really fast. I think we're going to have to eat our words. <laughs> oh, I'm just just taking back whatever I said. It's like really tight here. Um, so we see like Isa, maybe uh, some time or Isaac, hola, ¿qué tal? Um, um, so we have a really and nice. And the Czech now waking up and then thinking, yes. okay, let's I think they were too 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 too, uh, too, too uh, cocky, too big. Yeah. <laughs> and just see, <clears throat> yeah. Well, they were four zero, so you know you're like, okay, everything is well, everything oh, is under control. Or maybe the Australians did a, a change in the timeout. We haven't seen that. Maybe they have some fresh new players who know. are coming in. They're really uh, good. But it was a really nice goal from above. Uh, we saw here now yeah, it's four I two. Oh, there are oh. two against the goalie. That's quite uh, that's dangerous. But they, they recover the ball. To break free with the ball, but we're still in possession of Batwise here. It's a really uh, uh, greetings from Isaac. Uh, he's one of the Spanish national players watching. So right now we have 80 people watching the game. Uh, that's really nice here in underwater rugby. Now we have a fight there in the surface. I guess the Czech are, you know, trying to be in control of the ball so they don't reach another goal. It's 4-2. Still winning. Still two and a half minutes to go. But uh, the two goals happen very quickly yes. after each other. So they need to be wide awake now. It's still a really, really tight scrum there. At the I mean, surface. they've been fighting there for the last minute at least. I it's mean, two, there should two, be maybe a referee ball. Because they're killing, they're killing the time on purpose. They're delaying the game. So, so free the throw. delaying the game. Well, yeah, maybe. I don't know who is holding the ball, but I would say so. Um, so we have a referee call. Free throw, yeah, free free throw, throw again. Advice. Against the Australian. <laughs> We have more Spanish people here, Jorge, Jorge Acevedo in the chat. Um, nice attack from the Batwise team here, moving around the basket, passing a little bit into the middle field, coming back in attack, but the defense of goals is now really set here, trying to forecheck again. And there's one and a half minutes now, and we're still here, three meters away from the Australian team. One of the Czech players is trying to attack the goalie, but was tackled away. Three, and four, it's oh, the no, put up oh, the no, surface. They get, no, Eleven is about to recover the ball, but lost it. And the next Czech player just recovered and is waiting for the rest of the team to come and be ready for the next uh, attack. So now they are in the corner, holding the ball. The Australians are trying to recover it, following every player but the so checks one are one after go. the next one is one minute to go and they need to maybe it's just yeah start playing together again if three white players against four blue they are in the goalie then the corner we can't see but the australians are quite successful in keeping the checks uh, at the distance that is safe now 11 recovered the ball and now is trying to start a counter that what is tackle but and take away when the moment 31 of check thing it was a bit grabbing at the equipment. Much. The second 
We have 20 seconds left here. It's a free throw for Budweiser against Golds. Now Golds trying to get in there. There's 8 seconds left of this game. Now we are trying, and that's a goal from Budweiser from the open side. There was no defender there, just goalie and Budweiser. And that's it. That's end of the game. 5-2, the, the last minute. Yes. <laughs> Really tough game. Yes. I wouldn't expected it to go this way, but no. we saw some really nice two comebacks from the goals yeah. here, uh, which ended in in two goals from the goals. Yeah, and very and very quickly. I mean, that was really nothing we we expected it after the four zero led. Yes. So now it's coming up um, Vienna, the male team against Ege. So that's going mm, to that's be Vienna game. blue and Ege in white. And we can read the name of the players this is going to happen in four and a half minutes So we're back here seeing something and coming in um, a substitute for Lorena because she has seen something is Torte and of the games we're just eating some Tim Tams. And some Toffee Fee. <laughs> yeah, I'm preparing Next the Tim Tams. Where we go? Where we are? You go, it's... All right, back. Now we go and see Vienna playing against Ege. The champion from Austria playing against Ege University from Izmir in Turkey. We see, let us in the trees quickly, the teams. We have some time. Uh, let's start with the Vienna team, number four, Kindermann Jan. Tanzmann, Andreas, number 3, 20, Adner, Akko, 7, Marisek, Peter, 8, Wiesner, Jan Uwe, 9, Juffmann, Thomas, 10, Pont, Ulrich, 11, 9, Teufel, Matthias, 12, Pehl, Andreas, 13, Kalch, Gruber, Peter, 14, Denk, Thomas, 15, the Captain, Schneider, Bauer, Andreas, 18, Wimmer, Markus, 19, Landl, Baldwin, and 21, Thorsten, Lütke. So I'm just doing the Aggie University team. Thanks for that. Try your best. <laughs> yeah, try, I'm trying my best. Um, so Jacob, not Jacob here, told me that I'm pronouncing the Turkish team very <laughs> bad. So <laughs> um, <laughs> you're there. I'm just saying uh, sorry for the Turkish team if I will pronounce it not so good. Where's the Turkish Just team on try. the team list? No, that's women's. That's yeah. here. There it is. Um, so we have number one, um, Semi Özer, Number two, uh, Ceylan Unur. Number four, Özdemir Osan. Number five, um, Kan Bakir Sioglu. Number six, uh, Ugur Ceylan. Number seven, uh, Kerem Demir. Number eight, Mert um, Karkarok. Uh, Karakop. Uh, number 9 is uh, Ümit uh, Filis, number 10 is Hakan Togar, number 13 is uh, Athrak uh, Fati, number 12 is Ekin Kok, number 15 is Kaya Susan, number 17 is Levent Oskonul, number 77 is Ilkan Gokalp, and number 99 is Berkan Mert Suruku Oku. I'm sorry for pronouncing it. Um, Could be. 
so we had some tough games before here, seen from both teams. Vienna won in a, <coughs> a penalty shootout against the Barcelona team. And right now um, they play against Aga University, which also had some tough games um, in this championship.